Now I've got my GK4 powered up at uh, 16 Hertz. It shows up well on the monitor, the spin. Um, this is not the frequency that spins the compass. The compass spins it too um, because of the uh, resistance and the mechanical interference and the, the, whole, the whole mechanical process does, doesn't work good enough at the higher speeds because you're dragging the needle through space. This, on the other hand, is actually showing up on the magnetic field. This is 16 hertz. This is the best frequency. I can go, I'll go up and down for you. This goes uh, 17. Eighteen. Yeah, that's a good one right there. Nineteen. Twenty. It's getting a little bit too fast to see. And it's twenty-one, right? Yeah, it's twenty-one. Twenty-one hertz. It, I can see it spinning. I don't know if you, on the video it doesn't look too clear, but... Whoops. Doing it in 21, 22, 23. You can see them spin. You can see the colors going around. This is definitely, there you go. That's a good one right there. That is a 23 hertz. So it's, magnetically, it's, it's there all the time. It just depends on the, uh, the device you're using to read it how it shows up. See, there it's been the other way. So there's harmonics hat coming in. See, this is going counterclockwise, but I've got this thing being pulsed clockwise. So that was uh, 23 hertz. So we'll go up to 24. And the direction changes. This is a good demo right here. Okay, that's 24 hertz. It goes clockwise. 23 hertz. The harmonics are counterclockwise. Pretty slick, huh? And that's 24 hertz, 23 hertz, 22 hertz. Faster counterclockwise. So the 20, 23, 24, 25. There's a good video right there. So you can see the magnetic field spinning. Here's a good one. That's uh, 26. I'm sorry, 25 hertz. That's a good one. Kind of psychedelic, huh? Did this one go up? Uh, it's 25 still. It's 26. 27. Anybody got convulsions yet? 28. 29. There's a good, there's a good rotation there. So I'm seeing a different view on the screen than you see in the camera because the latency in the camera. But the field is spinning. It's just too fast to drag the compass around. The compass doesn't respond. It just jerks or it freezes. But on this monochrome, on this colored uh, VGA screen, you can definitely see the fields moving around. Anyway, that's all for it. that's all for now.